Trying to bring in some color into your projects? Easy. First, we need to turn our attention to the shading tab. These four options at the top are wireframe, solid, material preview, and rendered. In English, that means see-through, not see-through, color only, and color with light. Now, this bottom section here is called the shader editor, where colors and textures can be created using nodes. Go ahead and click new and give it a name. To add multiple colors to the object, click the plus, new material, change the object to edit mode with tab. Note that your mouse must be in the viewport for viewport shortcuts to work. Hover over the area you want to select and use the shortcut L to link selected, or select whatever you want to be the new color and then click assign. If you want an exact color from a picture, use the bottom left section. Hit open, find the image, open the image, and now we can use this eyedropper to pick an exact color. Play around with the settings on the node and see what you can make. If yours looks like this when you're trying reflections, here are the settings to let reflections work in Eevee. Turn on ambient occlusion, bloom, and screen space reflections with refraction enabled. And just like that, you have all the basic colors you could want. Deuces.